people Jennifer Ziliato back again on our color journey we are in week three and today we are talking about the solar plexus chakra all about the color yellow so I just wanted to start off by saying thank you so much for watching this series many of you have been commenting and letting me know how much you're enjoying it really appreciate hearing that. If you haven't caught this series, then I suggest that you start with number one, the root chakra, just so you can catch up with what we're doing. One of the really fun things about this series that has been for me is I feel like every chakra that we're talking about seems to really fit into kind of like the tone of what we're feeling so far this winter. And the solar plexus chakra, the th third chakra, it's in perfectly once again. This chakra is all about confidence. It's all about self-esteem, feeling good, finding your inner power or your inner fire, sort of, so to speak. And one thing that I have not touched on, we've talked a lot about the color um, associated with each chakra, but I have not talked about the crystals associated with each chakra. So today, that is what I'm going to talk about with you. So one of the simplest ways to balance your chakras is by simply bringing awareness. And color is a great way to do that. Eating the foods is a great way to do that. Like all the things we've been talking about over the last couple of weeks or by introducing some crystals. Maybe you love the way they look and you just simply want to bring them into your room as decoration, or you want to start by wearing them. Here I've got stacked these two new beautiful yoga bracelets from I Am Wired, the gorgeous Irene. This one is Citrine, and of course the other one is Tiger's Eye. And I've stacked them with an Anne-Marie Chagnon pearl bracelet, the medallion here and I just love the way this looks. It's really really simple, it's elegant and you wouldn't know I'm balancing my solar plexus chakra at the same time. So here is the beautiful citrine. It's kind of like a point form with this sort of like dark yellowy amber color with a little bit of white. It feels great in my hands. And the thing about citrine is it promotes happiness, it promotes joy, it gives you a lot of creativity, helps you feel um, really good about yourself, enhancing self-esteem, bringing abundance into your life, and also helping you to see the sunny side of life, which is something that I really love and I think is so perfect right now. It helps you kind of deal with some of the negative thoughts that you may be having, kind of lets that go away to the wayside. And it is really a joyful crystal. You can tell by the smile on my face. And then we have the beautiful, the almighty tiger's eye. This stone is a little bit smaller, as you can see. Um, polished it feels great again it's nice and smooth it's quite dark almost like a brownie orange and this is a wonderful protector uh, was often used as talisman uh, for protection again it helps promote self-esteem feeling of good helping you discern your own emotions as well as the people that may be around you. This stone gives you courage and confidence to um, succeed at your goals, which is a wonderful thing, I think, also this time of year, um, especially going into the month of February, now that we've kind of had a chance to sort of relax this January and mull over what we would like to see for the rest of the year. So this will help you put all that in place and help you be successful in achieving your goals and reassuring you of your personal inner power. 
is it my friends i hope you liked this video if you did please give it a thumbs up please subscribe to my youtube channel turn on that notification bell so that you know when i've uploaded another video leave a comment down below letting me know so far your favorite video in this series i would love to hear it or just simply if you have any other questions um, and that is it. And of course, don't forget to follow me on Facebook and on Instagram.